bloody brain suckers. I hate those things. Hate, 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 hate. Turn off your armaments because uh, there are some red dots over here and I don't want to uh don't want you to destroy half of the city. Let's see. Okay. <laughs> brain sucked agents pr uh, pretending to be not to be brain sucked. <laughs> I am completely fine. Where is uh, the base commander? And then he goes to the base commander. <coughs> kills him. Hello, my friend. Could you please tell me where is the base's self-destruct button? Oh, yes. It's right over here. Are you okay? Yes, I am completely fine. I have never felt better. Oh, that's good. It's right over here. The code for the uh, self-destruct is la 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 la. <laughs> Right. Right, 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 right. Let's uh, save uh, this. But we need... Because there will probably be more infestations, so I'm going to reload again, because I hate this bloody thing. Oh, no. Nothing at the moment. What is it, CSN Soul? What is it you wish to know? Ah, oh, Cyberweb. Right? Well. Back to 29 we go. Bloody Cyberweb. Uh, this is Cyber... No, this is Energen. Which one is Cyberweb? Are they... Well, they're unfriendly. Of course, they're unfriendly. Everyone is unfriendly to us. Bloody hell. Cyberweb, there we are. Uh, uh -huh. Lots of buildings. Well, let's go and uh, check them one by one, I guess. So annoying. So annoying. Italian accents. Okay, might try that, but I've already tried it and I'm not very good. See, they're everywhere, these aliens. Everywhere. <sighs> oh, no, not this map. I hate this map. <laughs> it's horrible. We've already played on it, if you remember, but it's horrible. It is horrible. All right. Okay. Team number one. Where are you? Uh, I think I'll just make my way inside here. We have to be really careful, though. Really careful. Uh, we don't want to do too much damage to this place, because they're already unfriendly, and it might just push them over into hostile. But we do have a sword here, so we're going to take the advantage of that, because I do believe this is the main area where uh, aliens usually are. Uh, either down here... Down here. Yes, I do, CSN Soul. I play lots of uh, stuff for my pre streams, lots of different stuff. We've played, well, Kerbal Space Program, Jedi Knight, um, SCP Containment Breach. Uh, what else have we played? I don't know. Quite a lot of stuff, I think. Uh, I've mostly, for my mainstream events, I've mostly only played XCOM so far, though. But, uh, yeah, once we finish this, we'll have finished uh, the original XCOM, the Terror from the Deep, and Apocalypse, again, and again, and again. So, I will have to pick something else. And I will probably just post a video where you guys will, you know, be able to tell me what you would like to see on the stream. Um, because, you know, I may pick something that will no, nobody will, re will really like. I might actually pick Kerbal's space, space Program, because everyone seemed to be having so much fun just watching the guys on the brink of death all the time, because they had a stupid control in the form of moi. Yeah. I don't actually have XCOM Interceptor. Yes, I have done UFO Enemy Unknown. I have done it several times. I've done it for my first ever LP, and I've done it for the stream. Before Apocalypse, actually. Uh, let's see. Ah, oh, this place is horrible. I think I should just press next. There we go. 
Oh, can hear them, but they're over to the north uh, west, if you can call it that. Civilians! Okay, good. Let's just check this place, just to be sure. Because sometimes they can be over here. Doesn't seem like they're here now, though. Nope. Alright, so, just making sure. Nope. Uh, Alright, you guys. Actually, there's nothing to see here. So, you guys will be going straight over here. Towards where we can hear there's some action going on. And this is the place. There we go. Two eggs. Don't really care about eggs. Uh, let's go... Does this go? No, it just goes down. This is very well where they might be, but nope, they're not here. That's fine. So they're definitely in that building. More in that building. Alright, team number two. You guys are going towards these doors, but I think... Because there's nothing here, you should actually go over here and peek through windows. And hopefully get some kills that way. Let's get you over here. Can you guys all... No, only one of you can fly. That's a bit unfortunate. We can see the eggs here. Anything else? Three of them. Oh, brain... Oh, brain sucker. No, 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 no. We are having none of that. Come on. Good night, brain sucker. Killed by excellent man. What? <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, two, two eggs and one brain sucker. Pathetic. And that is why we had to go here? Ah, for Pete's sake. And no doubt we will have more of these tiny infestations now. No doubt. Okay. Saving again. And we'll see <laughs> what we can see again. Alright. Nope. Let's see. Nope. Nothing. What about now? Nothing! Excellent! So that was it. Oh, <sighs> Good. Explorer! Excellent! Uh, somebody said in Italian. Uh, excellent, but I'm horrible with those. Um, the first... Um, <laughs> the first demand interdimensional vehicle produced for the initial exploration of alien structures. The craft only has a small equipment and armament la load and must conduct its excursions with great care. That was horrible! I don't want to do an Italian <laughs> anymore because I'm horrible at it. But this is great because we have the first interdimensional craft uh, that we can uh, build. We're not going to build it, of course, because it's very, very poor. But um, it will allow us to proceed to the Retaliator. Yes, the Retaliator. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Mamma mia, you want the spaghetti? Ah, <laughs> uh, don't talk about food, because I'm really hungry. Really, really hungry. Scottish, I could try Scottish, but... See, the thing with all of these accents is... I can really do them if I improvise. I can do them no problem. But if I have to read something that I've only found out in these streams, it just doesn't come. It just doesn't work for some reason. I don't know why. <sighs> yeah, domes. I did check it. Uh, hold on. Actually, played quite a few. Right, so there's nothing going... Oh, we should actually uh, get these people. No, wait. W you know what? We should do some raids. We should do a raid for our rookies. So let's get these back. And possibly kill them. <laughs> right, let's get all our rookies uh, on a raid. 
Right, these guys. Okay. <laughs> Stephen Hawking. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, mm, 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 something like that. You know, that thingy. Uh, right, which temple are we going to sh destroy? This one, I think. No, wait, 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 wait. What am I doing? We need devastator cannons first. Get back, I said. Pete's sake. There we go. There we go. Uh, right, these guys. Ah, this is the annoying. Oh, it does show us actually which ones are in the. Uh, the ship. This is the annoying part, though. I mean, you can't have loadouts, so we'll have to do this all over again when we go fight aliens, which is rather annoying. However, I am going to keep some toxicants uh, here because it is possible that we may meet some aliens as well if they're. But they're not infiltrated, though, are they? They're not. You know what? You're just going to keep that because you can't carry much stuff. Sean Connery accent. <laughs> well, Sean Connery accent is just... Yes, that is true. You know, it's just like that. I guess. I haven't watched Sean Connery that much, except in Bond movies, but even though everyone says uh, Sean Connery was the best uh, actor in the Bond movies, my all-time favorite... Sean Connery is great, but my all-time favorite for... James Bond is still uh, Roger Moore. Roger Moore is just amazing as James Bond. He is the perfect James Bond in my opinion. He's cool. He's you know he's cool. He's calm. He's uh, he's always well mannered, well dressed, and he's I don't know. He's just the perfect the perfect James Bond. Usually people disagree because they like um, they like uh, uh, Sean Connery more, and I can't dispute that. I mean, Sean Connery is very very good, but for some reason he strikes me more like an action guy, whereas Roger Moore is that you know polite spy. Uh, I don't know. They're just awesome. Uh, let's get these guys over here. I'm going to stop babbling about James Bond now and stuff like that. Because I'll start I'll just start ranting about how the modern James Bonds are total crap and how I can only enjoy the old James Bonds and blah 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 and oh well. <laughs> Fair seed, you haven't seen James Bond movies? And also, did you hear that? One of the uh, Cult of Sirius guys shot himself with an explosive. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> uh, silly Cult of Sirius. There they are. No, the, the problem is you only have 16 time units. And to shoot, you need 7. And you'll be exposed to lots of lovely fire. And that is already too far. Actually, you may do something. Take a pot shot. You missed. And now use a smoke grenade. James Pond, Robocard 2, huh? Right, let's drop that. Oh, that guy might have a heavy launcher. No, I think he's got a... I think he has a, um... Auto cannon. Well, let's get you guys over here. You could actually start going crazy. Like that. Nice. Run. Hey. Let's have some explosive ammunition here as well, Mr. Dirty Low Life. And uh, try to kill these ones. No, come on. Can you fly? Yes, you can. Do fly then. What? What happened? Shoot! No line of fire. Oh, that was better than nothing, I guess. 
Uh, you also have no more time uh, time units left. <laughs> time units. I wanted to say stamina and time units at the same time. What the hell? Right. So Captain K is getting another kill here. Ow! That sounded painful. Painful. Um. Bum, 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 bum. Let's get you over here. Let's see if there's anything over here. Possibly nothing. Nope. Nothing at the moment. Oh, I knew there would be someone over here. Hello. Ah, oh, you missed! Yeah. Let's get you over here. Do you have enough time units and stamina? I think you'll just have enough. Mr. Excellent Man. Oh, there's two of them. Hello! Uh, come on. Ah, for Pete's sake. Really? Horst. If my agent doesn't get a kill this time, just give him to someone else. What? Why do you want your agent given to someone else? That's an odd request. Oh, nice one. That was a kill for Horst. Uh, let's see. One more team. And they can both fly. That's good. Uh, let's get you over here. You can do some fun uh, mental stuff. Oh, both of you can, actually. Hmm. Oh, don't be such a baby G Thorning. These things take time. Why can't you see these guys? Is it because of the smoke? What the hell is going on? I don't want you to get closer because you'll just get shot. And now you probably don't have enough time units for an attempt. Oh, you do. And of course it doesn't work. Yeah. And you don't have enough time units at all. Well, Battle Bunny might be about to die again. <laughs> oh no, that was a heavy launcher. I don't like that. Oh, but we do have uh, three. Jeez, stop it. That actually went through the shields, apparently. No, don't use your toxic guns. <laughs> no. Oh, crap. No! Don't waste your toxic gun ammunition. Uh, everyone's shooting at Battle Bunny now. <laughs> Stop wasting the toxic gun ammunition. Ah, oh, for Pete's sake. Ow! Head. <laughs> Battle Bunny has died. <laughs> oh, jeez. Ah, uh, that was to be expected, wasn't it? I didn't expect them to have two. Um, two heavy launchers, though. Fifty-one. Oh, nice. We can actually uh, mind control this guy. He's got a laser sniper gun, though, which is completely rid. What? You can't move with ten time units? Okay, that's weird. Just drop your weapon. Oh, that's ridiculous. No. Oh. No, no, no! Just click there. There you go, G Thorning got a kill. And then he missed. Uh, let's move up. Who else is here? Mr. Vermoin. Oh, you only have these weapons. Hmm. Well. Armor-piercing shells will still do the trick if these guys are not shielded, which they're not. Well, unless you uh, miss, of course. Dirty low life. Uh, there's some stuff going on over here as well. We can go over here, and this guy has a heavy launcher. Die! Damn, that was not enough. They are a threat. Oh, Tom Wright. Oh, okay, that's that guy. It's not good, actually. An excellent man got another kill there. No one else inside here. Okay, that's fine. Now, we can actually make a door here, because we need to get here as soon as possible. And we're here already. That's good. Try to hit this one. 
Or you can miss, of course. Let's get you over here as well, Mr. Horst. Uh, oh, there's another one here. Do we have a stun grenade? We don't. That is annoying. Can we hit this one? Oh, nice. We killed the, the guy with the uh, heavy launcher. That's very good. Can we kill this one? Just don't kill your buddy. Ah, oh, that was so close. Captain K. Where are you? Oh, you're up there. Can you jump? No, you can't because you'll just fly. Alright, let's fly. And... Let's fly over here. How far can we fly? Oh, that's quite nice. We can actually kill this guy right now. Don't miss! Nicely done. Right, I think most of the stuff that was threatening us is now gone because these guys won't do much with laser sniper guns and, you know, that thing. Ah, you still have some time units, but you only have a Toxigon. And no more Psy energy. Oh well. This guy is panicking. See, this is how panic should be done. I'm pointing at the screen and, yeah, you can't really see me. <laughs> this is how it should be done. Not in the new game where panic means that the soldier will hit one of your soldiers. Or, in very rare cases, uh, an alien, if nobody is around. This is how panic should be done. It's just shooting all over the place. And all of these guys are panicking. That's brilliant. Right. Mr. Uh, Horst, uh, jump uh, down. <laughs> and run over to these guys and dispatch them. Oh, nice. And this guy. Nice. And another one. Excellent. That should be all of it, I think. Is it? No? It's not? Oh, right, of course. That mind control guy before. Uh, Vermoin. No, you, you have this. Right, let's get uh, G Thorning here and just finish this guy off. I think this should be it now. Yeah, that was it. G Thorning was promoted to squaddy. I think the game heard him crying and, uh, yeah. Nope, nope, turn off your weapons. Alright, that was a nice raid. Right, 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 right. Okay. Oh, we have some... Hmm, those are actually not bad stat, not bad accuracy, that's for sure. I think I'm gonna take her. I'm gonna take her! Uh, let's see, equipment. Actually, wait. We're gonna wait for her to arrive first. Oh, she's right there. In the slums. Living in the slums. Come on. Is she even moving? I think she's moving vertically, yeah. <laughs> I have a feeling our new recruit does not want to get over here. Oh no! This is ridiculous! Oh, but we can send her to a different building, can't we? Can we? Oh, brilliant! We can't even... control it anymore. Oh no, no, no! What are you guys doing? Get back! I wanted this woman... Maria Stewart. Where is she? Oh, that is... That's her. Get back to XCOM, bloody stupid. Great. <laughs> Apparently she's bugged. Oh, great. Wait, wait. She's here, isn't she? No. It said she's somewhere. Osiron oh, slums. Okay, okay. We can still get her. As long as she doesn't bug, bug out. So, let's take her. Excellent. That was weird. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Michael Blah. Maria Stewart. There's gonna be. Metal Bulani. X. Right. And now you're a proper soldier, you're not a. normal. Uh, no, <laughs> not a Psy soldier. I'm gonna give you flying armor and. some of this stuff. <laughs> 
five cyclones from that raid. That's quite very nice. Indeed. And we have to give people back their dad things. And some stun grenades and a smoke grenade. And I think that will do. Right, Michael Blah. To Birch, you need a stun grenade. Excellent man, you need your Toxigan back. Do 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 do. Uh, there we go. Nope. That's it. Good night, G Thorning. Welcome to uh <laughs> not welcome to the stream. Thanks for uh thanks for joining. See you next time. Bloody hell, Psycho Scorpions, look at that accuracy increase. That is immense. That's crazy. Alright. More ammunition. And more toxicants, and of course more stun grenades, because those are always nice. Fair seed. I could actually give the weaker guys uh, stamina-related uh, flying armor. You've got enough stuff, Captain K. I can also give that. Jeez, that's quite a lot of stats as well. Loads of speed, that's for sure. And a smoke grenade. Because the smoke grenade actually... Uh, ...helped us quite a few times in the past now. So it is very handy. We are running out of shields though, that's for sure. We'll, we'll get some more, that's not a problem. Alright, I think that's fine. Okay. Let's save here. Right. Anything else? Jeez, look at all these are unfriendly towards me. That is not good at all. Right. Refueled, Adam. And no infestation, that is excellent. Okay. XCOM Pop Tropica. Stores, stores. Alright. Of course, we have a second base in the making. Let's see it. Excellent. Wow, that is going to be churning out so many retaliators and annihilators. It's not going to be even funny. That's going to be awesome. Living quarters. We'll put some security stations here. Uh, no, 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 no. Right, let's get these guys back. Because we will have another UFO battle soon. Uh... Right, let's uh, spread out our craft. Oh, one is here. That's not nice. And these guys, yeah. Have to bring them over here. Closer. And the whole care warrior. Right. Okay. That's fine, I think. Let's go on. Light Disruptor Beam, finally! That little laboratory has been researching this for forever. Forever. Look, I never... <laughs> what are these things? <laughs> so weird. The, uh, the, um... Technology in Apocalypse is so weird. They've got mechanical uh, stuff fused with biological stuff. And, you know, th these cannons look very, very human made uh you know but the ufos that are firing them are completely weird just weird army accent cowboy accent chinese accent brit accent well i don't know which one to pick i'll do i'll do a cowboy accent i guess alien weapons technology is based on a complex subatomic particle system the disruptor beam is generated from an interdimensional power source, boy. It propels subatomic particles with disintegrated molecules in their path. I don't know what I'm saying here. The weapon does not require ammunition, since the energy chamber appears to be a self perpetuating energy source. That's something I need for my farm. Hopefully no, uh, no, you know, cowboys are listening to me because they're going to want to kill me. Right, disruptor inversion bomb, a medium disruptor beam. That's um I would very much like to 
got that. Oh, security station. Could do that, actually. Advanced security station. Because if, if they invade me, it's not gonna be pretty. I need those security stations. Biochemistry, anything? Nope, nothing. Um, <laughs> do we, how long is that thing gonna take? Four days still! That's ridiculous. Feels like forever. And UFO. No, Retaliator. Chinese voice. I, I, I can't really do a Chinese accent. I can do a Japanese accent. Very stereotypical Japanese accent, I guess. Um, the development of the Retaliator. I guess it could be a Chinese accent as well. I'm, I'm not sure. I haven't really um, heard many Chinese speaking English, uh, I guess. The development of the retaliator shifts the emphasis from exploration to attack. Our engineers have at last produced a craft which can match the capabilities of many of the alien ships. Or something like that, I guess. But that is awesome, a retaliator. We can't do the uh, annihilator yet. Because, uh, well, we need some more UFOs to research. Uh, we'll be doing the medium disruptor beam with these guys because it's quite a nice thing to have in the bigger ships. The Hawk Air Warrior can field it. And also the um, uh, the Retaliator will be able to field it when we make it. Uh, let's uh, save this again. Now we'll have another fight with UFOs, which I'm not really looking forward to. Oh, probes! This is brilliant!